In Plymouth Harbour, Gypsy Moss the Fourth rode at anchor a few hours before Francis Chichester departed on a round-the-world voyage. One way or another, it'll be a memorable one, for he'll be the only man on board. This famous sailor, hero of lone Atlantic crossings, now plans to sail by himself round the world. He made certain that all the stores he needed for the next hundred days were properly stowed away, his son helping him. Then, as she has done before at the start of his voyages, Chichester's wife bade him farewell. It needs an understanding woman to be the mate of a compulsive sailor. The spirit of Francis Drake still hovers over Plymouth Sound, and as Gypsy Moth got underway, all men of Devon and all Britain wished Godspeed and plain sailing to Chichester. Round the Cape of Good Hope, he'll follow the route of the clipper ships to Australia, returning round Cape Horn. All the good luck he deserves to a great sailor.